It was an emotional morning for some Londoners when members of the Commission of Inquiry into the shooting visited the Wisma Mackenzie Bridge. The commissioners who travelled from the city were greeted by a small crowd of mostly women. We want justice! We want justice! We want justice! Chance of justice quickly died as some of the commissioners interacted with persons at the scene. It was the sight of Senior Superintendent Clifton Hicken and Assistant Superintendent Patrick Todd that incensed the people. Todd headed a tactical service unit and admitted to shooting tear smoke and pellets to disperse the crowd on the bridge on July 18th. This morning, Commissioner Katie Knight asked Todd to explain when he reached the Wisma side of the bridge. I'll admit to the end of the the pestles were over, so I have to go into no action. Just stand and hold the bridge and report to the commander that the bridge was clear. Knight also inquired from Hicken where he was on the day after the shooting. The following day. The uh, following day yeah. you went to... Yeah, uh, joint service day. I think uh, he's a major, Powell, of no English from the army. And my team, we were playing rapidly to the fire service, going up as far as just after the station. Before that, one of the region's councillors and witnesses, Mr. Gordon Carlin, known as Badheart, sought to explain what happened on July 18th. After they come, they come from that direction shooting from till the end zone. And when they reach this side, they, they shot a woman down here. The woman is somewhere between here. And the first man that died, where, where those flowers are there? Chairman of the commission, Lensley Wolf, told him to save his testimony for when he appears at the hearing. The commissioner's departure from the scene was not without drama as person held placards and chanted in front of the bus. <laughs> Lawyer for the victims, Nigel Hughes, APNU lawyer Basil Williams and regional chairman Sharma Solomon had to appeal to persons to allow the commissioners to observe and to allow the surveyors to conduct measurements of the scene. Today, the commissioners visited One Mile Wisma where the road was blocked after the shooting and also the Wisma police station. For Prime News, Nazima Ragaber.